here is another video. So, Pia, what do you think about why do monarchies abolish? Oh, Pia has a good idea. Why do monarchies abolish? So let's discuss it here. So, there are 44 current monarchies in the world and many of the ancient monarchies may abolish. All the Nordic monarchies except Finland are still there and they are all ancient. Sweden was the oldest. Around the second century BC is when Sweden's monarchy started. But that, those were legendary kings. So, the historical king started in 970 when Eric the Victorious started his reign. He died in 995. So, let's talk about, but Sweden is a current monarchy, but let's talk about the the other monarchies besides Sweden and all those current monarchies. So, kings just like boss people around and kill people like Marie Antoinette, a queen said, off with his head, and then the, hmm, what was it? And then king say, time for war! But his people don't want to go to war. And then, for example, the king says, do this, or else, or else go off with your head, and that's not good. So, that's how monarchies abolish sometimes. At first, they don't want a person, for example, Julius Caesar, bossing them around everywhere. For example, they don't want a king bossing people around, so <clears throat> they want to abolish the monarchy. Right, Pierre? Yes. <laughs> and that's reason one. Reason two is they worship their king. For example, if the king loses a battle, for example, let's say, this battle is not real, but let's say, battle for, for example, what monarchy abolished? Austria. For example, battle with Austria versus England. Or oh, Austria lost. And all German monarchies. Wilhelm the second, Ludwig the I think it was the third or fifth or something like that. And whatever the other one's name was. So if a king they really worship loses a war, they are like, hey, that's not right. You, you broke the rules. Time to abolish you. Or let's say they are okay with a king, but they get tired of getting ruled by a king. For example, for an empire lasting from 1400 BC to 1961. That is way too long. What even, what empire would even last that long? So they thought, uh, it has been 2500 years since our monarchy. Let's abolish it. For example, And 
those are some main reasons the monarchies could abolish. Right, Peter? Yes. The penguin monarchy abolished because they were tired of ruling in Antarctica, even though Antarctica was not supposed to have a monarchy. Oh, Pierre, your country's monarchy abolished. Okay, let's put Pierre down. Bye. See you in my next video. Please like and subscribe.